So a little bit of R&D work today. This is the uh, pre-Puma Land Rover dash that we've got set up here. Um, so the idea of this project is to do a heating and AC solution for pre-Puma Defenders, uh, which had a quite archaic system. Um, if you had AC on one of these things, you had to bolt a unit under the dashboard. We didn't like that. So uh, we've designed a new lower unit. So this is the unit um, that we've designed. This is actually a, weirdly, this is a left-hand drive unit fit, fitted to a right-hand drive dashboard, but ignore that for a second. This would normally be outboard of the, of the unit in the wing. Um, so air comes in here, gets blended in here, there's a heater, an evaporator, and then it gets shoved into the bottom section of the dashboard. Um, but that presents a problem because this is made of metal, it's against a, a hot bulkhead because you've got the engine on this side. Um, so what we've done internally here is we've redesigned the internals of this bulkhead to uh, stop the um, the air basically getting lost inside this box section. So it all runs in ducts inside here, but as you can see, there's no real impact on the originality of the dash tray or any bits and pieces. But what we have done is repurpose this center section. So normally when you buy a Land Rover, this one's very, this looks like it's been in a farmer's field, but you usually end up with just a cigarette lighter and a, a rear screen washer on this panel here. Um, but weirdly, when you take this off, you find there's two nice little holes. So we're going to design a inset panel there with a nice couple of vents. Um, you've got your screen vents and under here you've got your foot well vents, which we'll get to in a minute. Um, this is all going to be blended with electric servo valves. So something like this unit will be fitted in behind here and that will allow you to control the air to the screen or to your feet. Um, so does it work? Well, check this out. <laughs> I think that's about the most air you'll ever see coming out of a, a Land Rover dashboard. Um, measured this at nearly 60 miles an hour, this air here. Uh, probably a bit insane to be honest, but um, it's always better to have more air, right? <laughs> so, so there we go, coming soon.